All right, folks, here we go again with another beautiful, gorgeous 2008 Chevy Tahoe SSB package. What that means that this is a 4x4. And yes, it kind of looks like a PPV as well. Anyway, 2008 Chevy Tahoe SSB package with 110,000 miles, 4x4, original titanium gray from factory vehicle does have little minor scratches and it does have a few door dings once again folks this is the original paint this was a former las vegas nevada swat team officer take home take home vehicle that is correct guys this was a swat team officers take home vehicle i do have a fresh new window tint dark all around when we first got the car the vehicle did have a window tint but it looked purplish so we went ahead and uh, had it redone so yes dark all around the vehicle is gray it kind of looks beige but it's not folks before i proceed let me tell you one of those door dinks is gonna be here on the gas lid it does open and close, no problem. This is gonna be an E85 vehicle. You can see some door dings right here. Not sure where, that's, where that, that came from. And I do have some scuff marks on the rear bumper. Folks, once again, this is not a repaint. So you're gonna have uh, a few little scratches and door dings here and there. It does have a uh, tow package. And as you guys can see, the vehicle has been registered. So yes, I do have a... Uh, California registration and title up to date on hand ready for the next owner Folks this vehicle is in immaculate running condition and shape She has been serviced detailed and she doesn't need any repairs whatsoever and she's literally turnkey ready to go anywhere across the country Folks, road trip, road trip it is. Folks, I do have some more door dings right here. I got a few right here. Uh, they're hardly visible, but they are there. If you get close enough, you'll see them. Also, I do have a, a brand new set of uh, tires all around. And also, folks, I do have a brand new set of police type OEM steel wheels. The ones that came with the car, they look good, but I wanted to do something different. We had the budget, so I did it. So the car does look a heck of a lot better now. I do have clear lens and lessons on the front. No signs of uh, any spotlights ever being installed in the vehicle. Folks, if you are looking behind the grill and inside the glass, this vehicle is equipped with lights. That is correct. We'll get to that in a minute. Folks, I also have uh, some door dings here on the hood, possibly from the vehicle being out on the road, on the highway or whatnot. I do have some door dings. This vehicle that does, does not have any holes whatsoever. All right. Some more door, door dings and scratches right here, folks. All right. If you guys can see past these little scratches and door dings, you got yourself a great looking SUV. Let me tell you, folks, I'm not even lying. I love this truck right here. I really do. One of my favorites. There you guys have it. Let's go inside. Show you what, what we got to work with here. Once again, folks, this was not a patrol vehicle. This was a uh, SWAT officer's take home car. And for those of us that are familiar with these type of vehicles, we know that they get the best care that there is in the department. Why? Because these vehicles do need to be completely dependable and reliable out on the road. So they get the best treatment ever. Here we go. I do have a, a nice leather rear seat, vinyl floors, rear door locks and switches are fully operational so yes you can get in and out of the vehicle if you do have passengers all right no holes anywhere on this vehicle she is just about in perfect conditions 
once again this is going to be a 2008 i do have a nice comfortable driver side seat i do have a nice new aftermarket center console passenger side seat appears to be in new shape i don't think uh, no one ever sat there I do have one key with the vehicle, one key with the vehicle. I repeat, only one key and one fob. Let me clean this up here for you guys. Perfect looking dash, honk works, four by four, headlight switch. I mean, everything's here, everything does work. Let's go ahead and fire her up. Let me clean this up here for you guys. All right, here we go. Pressure lights are off. I do have 110,000 miles. It's going on 111. One little crack here on the dash. Nothing big or major to worry about. It's coming on these vehicles. Um, perfect headliner, folks, by the way. Perfect headliner. All the little lights, courtesy lights, do come on when you open the door. If you guys are looking at these lights right here, Stereo does work. Stereo does work. YouTube, I do not, I do not own the rights to the song. It does work. Nice and cold air conditioner. Cigarette lighters. Stay tuned for that. That is a federal signal uh, siren. All right, we're gonna have to step it up here. Did I forget anything? Da -da 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 -da. Hope not. All right. Sorry about that, guys. The gas toilet, it really gets me, but I don't know what happened, but it's, I'll do some adjustments on that, but I'd rather just leave it alone. This is the back of the vehicle. Some cutouts on the floorboard, possibly from a, maybe a utility box back here somewhere. Once again, headliner, nice and perfect. Lights, lights. This light does work as well, and the tailgate. Let me step it up here for you guys because I do have a lot of ground to cover on this one. Let me go ahead and close this. The hood is open. Folks, this vehicle looks extremely mean coming down the road. I got compliments from other people out there that they thought this was a federal unit, an FBI vehicle, and I said, no, it's a personal, but they were fooled. Here's the engine, folks, starting left to right on this one. I do have a uh, new air, air filter. I do have eight new AC Delco Platinum Spot Plus and cables to go with it. I do have two new belts. I do have a new uh, drive belt and one air conditioner belt. Throttle body was serviced and cleaned out. I gotta tell you, folks, we also did a uh, perform a uh, BG fuel system treatment on this one. To clean up all the gunk out of the fuel lines and so that the vehicle could run better. Our stereo is nice and full. I do have two, mat two AC Delco batteries from the department. The whole vehicle's got a nice setup. You guys can see that the vehicle has a, like a uh, power inverter here. This is connected to both of the batteries. And it goes right here to this Napa charging center. What this means, folks, that your batteries will never go low, and if you are running equipment on the vehicle, guess what? That's what you wanna have, all right? This is a setup that was done by that department. I'm not removing it. I decided to leave it alone. To leave it alone, I'm sorry. Also, if you wanna charge up another vehicle or jump start another car, you can do it from here, or if you wanted to charge up the batteries, you can connect to the wall from here. Once again, this setup was done by the department, not me. I found it and I left it alone. All right, folks, did I forget anything else? Da, 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 da. Rear differential fluids was uh, checked, didn't need anything. Brakes are about 80% all around, so I didn't need anything. New wheels. All right, folks, let me close the hood. Uh, the engine runs perfectly, no funny noises, ticking or any type of the those type of engine noises very smooth very strong
Stay with me, folks. I gotta hurry up. This little light controls that little light right there. All right. Let me go ahead and turn this off. Turn this off. This little light, the center button controls the strobes. All right, it's got strobes. You guys can see that. Folks, what you see is what you will get. And if we hit the third little light button, stay with me folks, stay with me. I need to hurry up, I got 12 minutes. Gotta make it count. Sorry, I'm sorry, uh, uh, folks, I'm sorry, I gotta move. I gotta move. Here you go. That work. Air horn works, siren works, very loud. I'm not gonna hit the siren because I don't wanna scare my neighbors. So, yes, folks, the vehicle is fully loaded. It's got some equipment. She is ready to go. Once again, I'm on my, my neighbor's way. Here it is, folks. Uh, thanks for watching. You guys have a blessed weekend out there. Please be safe. Thank you and take care. God bless.